What's up, guys? It's Dope Strings here. Um, I need to freaking change up my thing. I said change up what I say when I get on with you. I don't know, man. But anyways, man. Hey, the topic for today, man. The topic for today is why are drivers leaving Prime right now? Why are a bun Why are a lot of drivers leaving Prime right now? So we're gonna talk about that right now. We're gonna talk about it. Um. Why are drivers leaving prime? There are a number of reasons why drivers are leaving prime right now. A number of reasons. This is one. This is a one major reason, but it's a lot of other reasons, not just that one reason. And a lot of you guys, um, gals, y'all, y'all know what I, um, y'all know, y'all know why, y'all know why. If you are prime right now, um, let's start off with revenue. <clears throat> All drivers aren't facing the same um, same things when it comes to revenue. Like me personally, I'm not. Um, but there are drivers that are. Um, and a lot of drivers are leaving Prime because of revenue. Um, they're not making they're not making the money. Um, for the most part, it's it's not it's not. I wouldn't say owner operators. I say for the most part, it's um, lease operators. Um. They're not making the money they need to make. Um, a lot, a lot of them, they have their expenses at home are too high. Um, they're spending way too much money. Um, like I say, man, I be trying to tell y'all get y'all expenses at home low as possible. If you don't need something, get rid of it. Like a car or something, you can get, go get a cash car. Um, I'm, you can, you can, you can make the money pretty quick to grab, grab a cash car, bro. You ain't got to buy a ten thousand dollar car. Go buy a little five, a little five thousand dollar car, bro. You ain't you ain't home that much. If you home that much, I mean that's another reason why your revenue is low. You're home a lot. You run the business, but you want to be home all the time. You want to be home all the time. Just get your just get you a local job. But um, yeah, a lot of drivers are having issues with revenue. Um, they don't know the steps in order to change fleet managers. Um, a lot a lot of things like that, man. Um. But they also, they're not, they're not also not running like, they're not running like, oh, I want to say correctly, but the reason their revenue is so low is because they, they lightly gag, bro. Um, as soon as my clock reset, I'm gone. I'm gone. And it also depends on the, it also depends on the freaking, um, the, the 90 when it comes to that. If, I mean, because some places... You're not gonna get empty early, like Walmart. Let's just say the Walmart. If you got a um a live unload, you can only get there an hour early. You can't do that with everybody. But they're not getting to these ship. He's not. Get, they're not getting to these shippers receiving, trying to see if they can get loaded early or unloaded early. They're not. They're not doing that. They're waiting until around that that appointment time. Then they go in. Um, you. I mean, you know that the the, the trucker, the trucks that get um, the trucks that get the that uh. Let me, let me put it like this. It's it's a number of trucks on the board. The trucks that empty first get that load first. Um, that's how it works. If they, get, if they got an abundance of loads in that area, that's when they have a pre-plan for you. If they, if they filled all the other trucks in that area and there are some extra loads um, on that board, then that's when they send the pre-plan out. Um, but it's 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 not before not 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 it's not before that um if drivers are in that area and they get unloaded before you and they're empty on the board they they're the ones that're going to get that load um i wouldn't say they get the best loads i mean but they're going they're going to get a load and they have the option to um accept or decline that load and they might they might get a better load you never know bro you never know with that but yeah a lot of drivers aren't seeing the revenue right now um, that's why, that's one of the reasons a lot of drivers are leaving, bro. They're leaving Prime, going to other companies. Um, but they all, I mean, you got to take into account how much home time you take, bro. Um, if you don't have an emergency fund, you go going in the hole that week. So you might not make money for like, well, with, with um, well, at least you might not make money for like a few weeks. And you can't, you can't just be mad because, um, now you, you don't make money for a few weeks because you decided to go home and you didn't do it the correct way. Which I tell people, um, when I was lease operator, I went home on, um, I scheduled my home time for Friday. I can't, no, I scheduled my home time, I think, for Saturday. 
I think I kept, I, I think I kept my home time for like Saturdays. And I will come back out on a Monday. So I get, I get Saturday, Sunday. How did I do that? Hmm. No, I will schedule it for Friday. Okay, okay. I do, I do, I schedule for Friday. So I'll get Friday, Saturday, Sunday. I get those three days at home, and I come out on Monday. For a lot of people, that's not for a lot for a lot of people that's not enough, but it was enough for me. Um, and with that, I get I, I was able to get like maybe one or two loads in for that week. And it'd normally even out. That's how I ran. That's how I ran. And I was least I prayed. That's when I when I did um take home time. So that's how I stayed out of the negative or I, I, if I dipped into the negative, I was um it's only like like 100, 200 bucks, which ain't bad. I can normally get you I mean you should be able to get out of that next week. Unless you got didn't got a breakdown or something like that. Um but yeah, I was doing pretty good as a least operator, bro. My work ethic, everybody work ethic ain't ain't the same. Um, but another reason that drivers are leaving prime right now, the camera situation, a lot of drivers do not want a driver facing camera and it's understandable. I don't, I personally don't want a driver facing camera, but push come to serve. I, I'm just, I'm just like fed up with it. Like I, I don't, if I'm just like fed up with it, I just go to a different, different company to be honest. I just take my truck with me. Um, so that that'd be cool with me. I could just leave. I could just leave prime and take my truck with me. Um, but a lot of drivers, I don't know. I don't know, bro. The camera situation is crazy. Um, a lot of drivers do not want to drive facing camera. Major, I'm gonna say the majority of the world does not want to drive facing camera. Cause it's like, I don't want nobody to look at me 24 seven. I mean, it's just one more thing that I gotta pay. I, I gotta look at. Like I'm, I'm. You got, I mean, you got drivers that's gonna be constantly staring at that camera. That, I mean, that's another accident waiting to happen because they they're, they're so focused on like, are they looking at me right now? Like, I mean, prom say they don't do live or whatnot. I mean, if you want to believe that, you can believe that. It's not. It's not. It's, I mean, that. I mean, if you. I mean, you can say that, but it's like, prom is loud about a lot of other things. This ain't the first time. Um, this ain't the first time. So you got you got to think about that, bro. You got to think about that. You got to think about. I'm, I'm, trying, I'm trying, trying, trying in my head to think about what have they lied about? Um, oh, cameras. They, I mean, they lied. They even lied about the camera situation. There will never be any cameras in the truck. Y'all see, that was not the case. They lied about that, bro. Now they have cameras in the truck. It's like. I don't know, bro. If it was like a, a requirement by the, um, by the, I guess, FMCSA, if it was a requirement by them, that'd be one thing, but it's not. And you see, we get, we're getting cameras put in the truck. Um, but I mean, that's also to blame a lot of drivers. They don't freaking, they don't pay attention. They don't freaking, um, they always mess up. Like, bro, you got drivers that are freaking, um, they're not wearing seatbelts. Like, Stupid stuff like 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 bro, why is you not why are you getting seatbelt tickets, bro? Like if you get a seatbelt ticket, that should be that should be one and gone. I would fire people if you ain't got no seatbelt on. Cause it's like, bro, what are you doing? If you ride with if you ride in the yard without a seatbelt on, that's one thing. But if you ride on public roads without a seatbelt, it's like, bro, what are you doing? Like what are you doing? Like, bro, it, I mean, like what? How you get a, a seatbelt ticket, bro? That's like the that's that's crazy. That's crazy. So I would, yeah, I would definitely have to fire people. They they got a seatbelt ticket. I would get you a body though. Okay, it's like, bro, if you if you can't even put on a seatbelt, uh, what else? What else you are you not doing? But um, yeah, it's still. I mean, we got drivers that's freaking. They speed through like small towns. Like, come on, bro. Why are you speeding through a small town, bro? Why? You don't. It don't. I mean, like, like, what are you trying to do? You had enough time on your load, so what are you doing? It's like stupid stuff like that, bro. So a lot of a lot of drivers are putting this on everybody else. It's, it's y'all fault. And then and then what's crazy is is it be those drivers' fault. And when they finally get caught up for it, they get fired. I mean, they gone, but we still here. So we got to deal with what past drivers have done. It's crazy, man. It's crazy. Um, yeah, it's crazy, man. Yeah, it's crazy. Nobody want the camera situation, bro. Nobody want the cameras. Trust me, nobody wants the camera. If it was a vote within all the drivers at Prime, I 
will bet that the drivers at prime majority it might be less than 100 people that say they excuse me it might be less than 100 people that say they want the camera but majority they don't want the camera they do not want the camera but guys what else what else do i have for you um why, why are drivers leaving prime right now Um, the other reason drivers leave, drivers are leaving Prime. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm looking at this truck because it was a different it was a different dually that came back here. Looked at this trailer and that's another dually. I'm trying to see if it's like the towing people or something. Yeah, guys, another reason that drivers are leaving Prime right now. Why are drivers leaving Prime? Let me, let me, let me think. I mean, a lot of drivers leaving Prime because of dispatchers, too. Um, uh, they don't know that they can change dispatchers. I'm not, I'm not understanding that. Why are drivers leaving Prime because of dispatchers? They're leaving Prime because of dispatchers, man. It's like, bro, you can change dispatchers. Don't get me wrong, it's not the freaking quickest process, but I mean, it's a process. Um, I'm, I'm not going to too much indulge in that. Um, uh, what, what, what are some more reasons that drivers leave Prime? Um, I can't really think about no other reasons, to be honest. Um, if you guys, you guys have some, some, some um, have some reasons why drivers leaving Prime, let me know. Let me let me know down below. I think those really are, are the main reasons right now why drivers are leaving Prime. Um, but anyways, guys. Catch me on my next video. Um, I think my next video will be um I don't know. I have I watched a video. I watched a video on YouTube. Um I believe I believe the YouTuber, he's a I think I believe he's a driver at Prime. I think it's no hippie life or hippie life or something like that. Um it's something like that. I can't remember. I just, I just subscribed to him. But I want to I want to make a video um um playing off his video because he actually gave a lot of good information in that video. If you um seen a video where he um he's giving reasons on why he's no longer um why he shut down his fleet. Cuz I I've had some questions. I mean not questions, but I've asked the questions already. I had some, I had some um I had asked a lot of questions to a lot of other fleet owners that I know at Prime and he actually gave it. He actually gave information about stuff I didn't even think about, to be honest. So I'm gonna make a video playing off that one for my next video. Anyways, guys, I'm gonna catch you on the next one. This is Dope Strings, and I'm out. Peace.